the crows are unsure of new things. <laughs> and the hexagon canvas is a new thing. It's very new. Hi, okay, buddy! Hi! Hi. <laughs> All right. Okay, Abbott. We used to have the crows just uh, step in paint, um, and we changed it. Are you ready? What do you think? Brave. It's a lot. It's a lot, isn't it? Yeah. It's a lot. You ready? <laughs> Can you come over here? That's very good. Do you think you could paint? No. <laughs> you ready? Want to try again? You're so brave. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Good. Good job. <laughs> So Abbott and Coconut are American crows. They were born in the wild in Central Texas, and they were blown out of their nest by a storm and then raised by people. And when they were raised by people, they imprinted on people. Um, are you so ready? they don't know how to take care of themselves in the wild. That's why they're here. Can you come paint? You can paint. Abbott has a lot to say. Always has. Good. Very good. Good. That is correct. Okay, you have to put it over here though. Can you paint? Good. Oh my god, that he's doing correct. it. It was upside down, but that's okay. Can you paint over here? Good. Good job. <laughs> Good. I said, holy shit, crows learn so fast. They do, they're very smart, but this is not the first time Abbott uh, is painting. Abbott has a few paintings that'll be up for auction tomorrow. Are you ready? Um, it's just different because, uh, one, we're in here with the DSLR, and uh, this is a hexagon-shaped canvas instead of a rectangle. <laughs> so, chat, when we're training animals new things, I'm going to paint this way. This way. <laughs> it's okay. This way. It's the wrong way. You're doing a great job painting the platform. Paint. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> right. Good job. Good job. So when we're training animals to paint, um, or when we're training them to kind of approach new things that might be very scary to them, uh, what we do is we break up a behavior into what we call approximations. Uh, and what approximations are, are just looking at a behavior. So what I want Abbott to do right now is to drop the sponge on this canvas. So what I'm doing to start is just reinforcing him for approaching the sponge or approaching the canvas. Paint. So you might see after he tries a couple times, if he does not get it right, I'll reinforce him for something that's a little bit less than the full behavior. Good. Which would be putting the sponge on the canvas. But if he touches the sponge a couple times, that's pretty good. If he approaches the canvas, that's pretty good. And those are all smaller things that I need him to be okay with. <laughs> Paint. Is that all you're going to do today? Paint. <laughs> we have a few sponges. A few little bits. Um, but if I were to put the whole canvas up here, he might be a little bit unsure. So we're going to try because he's accepted it. Are you ready? I'll try one more time. Is it too much? You decide. Good. Can you paint? You can do it. Good. So there he just looked at the sponge next to the canvas, which is big and scary. Can you paint? The wind is at your back, which is not nice. Good. It's very good. Paint. You can do it. Good. Good job. <laughs> very good, buddy. That might be as much as we get today, Chad. But you can see the kind of the progression that we look for when we're doing new behaviors. Um, the safest thing when you're training an animal to do something is to assume that it's going to be a very scary thing. Because if you unintentionally scare them, uh, it's much harder to make something not, uh, to make something that is scary not scary than it is to introduce something new and make them comfortable. You can paint. Paint. Good. Wow. Good job, buddy. Can you come up over here? Good. And then before I move that big scary canvas away, I'm making sure that he's not anywhere near it so that I can't unintentionally scare him with it. So we have a couple little Abbott Yay, sponges. Cute. <laughs> they were, I think, unintentional on his part, but. <laughs> Good job, Abbott. I don't think Coconut has ever painted. Uh, not, he's 
this year he got really close. He was comfortable coming down like next to Abbott while Abbott was painting. Mm -hmm. um, but we've not gotten Coconut to interact with a sponge yet. What color for the foxes? I we saw mix... yellow. We don't have yellow, do we? No, but we can like mix red and orange and we might get a fun color. Okay. Okay, Kaylee, you want to show them your contraption? This is actually very right. innovative. So it's very similar to what we used to paint with the chins and the rats because we don't want them to end up with paint on them, especially the chinchillas. So essentially what they do is they have like a little ink pad and it has ink on this side, the underside, and then they press down onto a piece of paper and we get their little footprints. So I just made a little fox one that we're just gonna put here and it'll have paint on the underside and hopefully we'll get a footprint. They will step on it. Incredible. And we will get a fox print. That is the hope. But it's Ingenious. a very specific spot to step, so we'll see how it goes. Ingenious. We will see how it goes. I also like, like I said, I've never, uh, never done this before, so hopefully I don't put either too much paint or not enough paint on it. Hi, Finn. There's so much oh. room in here without the camera. Hold on. I gotta, my bad. I lied. If they pee on it, it's worth more. They're not gonna pee on Hello, it. Hello, Finnegan Fox. Hi. How Hi, you buddy. doing, buddy? Yeah, he's got his pantaloons on still. Give him some time. Kid. He's working on them really constantly. Hot. He'll get them off. He's shutting out. The fox is Finn uh, was confiscated from the illegal pet trade in California. See, look, he's using that brush to try to get his pantaloons off. He's shedding. He's doing a great job. <laughs> and then Reed was orphaned in the wild. Central Coast, California was raised by people um, habituated two people um, and never got the chance to, to be released. Wow. All right. So he also doesn't know how to take care of himself. XGH, thank you. Gets any bright ideas to steal my sponge? All right, Mr. Finn. Wow. We'll see how it goes. Do you want to come check this out? This is a cool painting thing. It is. Thanks for coming over. Oh. Sorry, bud. Oh, oh, oh. Think about it. It's okay. Thanks for coming over. It's very brave. Yeah, they did. They dug all the holes yeah. in here. Yeah. I don't have enough hands to do with a target stick, so we're just gonna kind of see if you'll walk across it for me. Okay, come on. Good. It says no. What do you want? Can you step? Good. Good job, bud. Not quite, but almost there. Is it good? Yeah. Can you step across the painting? Big step. <laughs> good. Wow. Good job. Can you do a big step? Big step. You can do it. Big step. <laughs> Come on. Little step. Little step. You can do it. Good job. Very <laughs> brave. <laughs> Very brave. So with the foxes, we teach people that... Good. Oh, wow. Good boy. Good boy. Amazing. That's very good. Teach people that you don't want foxes as pets and also not to wear furs. Can um, I lift this up so we can see what it looks like so we don't do another step right wow! on top of it? <laughs> oh my gosh, amazing! <laughs> it's a little streaky, but that's okay. It's beautiful! It's okay, it's a little streaky, but it's okay. Can I put some more paint on it? Then you did it! You did it. Imagine he pees on it. <laughs> <laughs> don't pee on it. <laughs> um, they still have fur farms where they raise animals. Uh, solely for fur. Um, don't do it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> don't do it. We're really so sad. proud of it so far. <laughs> All right, buddy. Should we try one more? Would add value. Just I'm going to be honest. See there's like do. probably a little bit of chicken poop in the paintings if you guys are... There is 100% <laughs> some, um, some dirt. Some dirt in there. In, uh, I think, Stompies and, and Winnie's. Winnie's. For sure. Yeah. Finn! Mr. Finnegan Fox. Finn! Are you done? I mean, you can be done. We do have a print that's very nice of you to offer. Read any chance. <laughs> Imagine. Uh, he's coming. Do you want to come over and get some more chicken? Good job. Very good. Take another step. One more. One more. Oh, that was my <laughs> hand. That was scary, wasn't it? It's okay. <laughs> it was scary, wasn't it? Do we just hold hands? Wow. Good. <laughs> So you can see like any time his foot touches that, um, no matter what, good. No matter what, good buddy, good job. Wow. That was actually my last piece, you did great. <laughs> uh, anytime his foot touches it, um, 
he got a tidbit. You did it! Amazing! You did it! That's it! It's so good! Chat, check out that canvas so far. What? The painting to rule all paintings. The super collab. <laughs> the super collab! <laughs> All right. Good job, Finn. Thank you. Amazing. You're